Welcome to our daily hobbies. I'm Mika Namakan, and today we're playing for the game Laser Fear Inheritance. Where this time we play from the perspective of the painter's daughter, who's returned home to face their past. When I was a child, I used to lay in bed late at night, staring at the ceiling, listening to my father scream. Scream at my mother, scream at yet another failed masterpiece. Finally, just scream out into the darkness. It became my lullaby. And even when they took me away, the screams followed. I was once told that insanity runs in my family. It's time to make it stop. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, hello. I remember this house well. Dear friend, today, before I leave for my new appointment, I intend to make one final attempt to communicate with you. Since you have obviously decided not to answer my calls or letters, I shall endeavour to speak with you in person. If you're reading this, then I have clearly failed, and for that I apologise. Should you choose to ignore me, I will slip this letter under your door. Hopefully you can at least read it, for old time's sake. If me knocking on the door has caused you any discomfort, please know that that was not my intent. I wish I could tell you that I found some miracle solution to your problem, but unfortunately, such is not the case. Do know that, as your legal representative, I always did my best, and that is the God's honest truth. Unfortunately, I feel that the issues you're struggling with go way beyond my expertise. At this point, I once again feel the urge to ask you to reconsider seeking professional help. But let's be honest, if you were to listen to me, you would have done it a long time ago. I regret it had to end this way. Know that you and your family will always be in my thoughts. Your old friend, James Jerome Sadler, attorney at law. Oh, okay then. Well, I'm guessing since the note was on the floor. Father did not read you. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. But a lot of paint. Oh, I figured how painty this house is. Wow, you've got it quite literally everywhere. And yes, look, there's father's bottles once more. Mother? Mother, is that you? I hear you. I shall come to find you, mother, that's it. Hello? Oh, I found the kitchen. Ugh. Oh, it reeks in here. Ew. Wait, shouldn't these be far moldy than they actually are? Is somebody once more living in this house? Everything has been emptied, except one, well, two singular pots. Hmm. Oh. I swear that dog doesn't shut up. Uh, what? What are you doing? Are the father talking here? Oh, Popo! How the hell did you get out? Go on, get out of here, Popo! Before I find a way to keep you in there for good. I found our dog. Oh. Hey, the paprika is still here. There we go. What? Oh. Did you break our dog in? Why would you do that, father? Okay, well, father definitely killed the dog. You're a monster, father. Wait, did you, like, cook him or something? Is that what it showed on the picture? You are not a very nice chap, father. Oh yes, another one of your bottles, bourbon whiskey. You feeling thirsty, father? Hmm. Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything else here for me. Well, at least, no, I would say I saved our dog. Hey, at least the scale still works. We've got no need for that, though. Anyway, I was looking. For mother's music? Maybe. Oh, the bathroom! Is this the one you died in, mother? Can I. There? 
is no water. I mean, are we really surprised to have burned down this place? Is? Oh, there is flies here. Oh. Wait, why? Why won't you... Wait, okay. Why wait for hell? You deserve it now. Uh, is that, is that aimed towards our father? No, the flush still does not work. Don't know why I'm surprised. It didn't even work in the base game. Okay. Where else can I... Ooh. Oh, even though the mouse traps are still here. Oh, did we keep setting them off as a child? Is that what used to happen? Oh! <coughs> oh this place is a mess. Just dropped a bunch of mouse traps on me. Oh, oh, I'm back again. Hear you in there. I'm coming, you furry little bastards. You're not getting away this time. Oh, the rats. Oh, what the hell are you doing in there? Get out. I didn't do anything. I'm doing nothing. Father, you are very aggressive. Okay, don't think there's anything else in here for me. I had almost forgotten about our father's obsession with the rats. I swear, mother, where is your music? Come oh, curses. Why not allowed to go upstairs? Oh, there's just a painting there. I didn't realize. Okay, am I not allowed? Oh, I am. It's just a bit janky for some reason. Never mind, I made it. I struggled through. And I hope... Uh, okay. What's wrong with this thing? What thing? Which thing in particular? There's a lot of things that you could be referring to. Rat. Lies, 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 lies! Do we think Father was, was calling it a liar? That dog better not be where I think it is. Popo! Popo, get off the couch! Popo, hide! Hide, Popo! I will protect my dog over you, Father. Oh. Hey there, princess. Damn, nope. You, you want to sit on daddy's lap? Nope. Come on. You killed my dog. Okay. Don't like you, father. You protect the popo. Oh, I found your office again. Hello. Is there anything here for me? I do like reading the notes. I remember there used to be a door there. In my detrimental... Memory state? They may have just been going insane. One of the two. All of your drawers are empty. Okay. Oh, that's a mistake. They are not. Last will and testament. I, grasping at the remains of my sanity, declare this to be my last will and testament. I hereby deem all of my previous wills just as worthless as the shallow husks calling themselves my friends and associates. To my agent, Thomas Coldwell, I bestow the hellish vermin that infest my home, praying that they will gnaw away at him endlessly, bleeding him dry just like he did to me. To my publisher, Leon Brickstone, I bequeath the flames that consume the love of my life in hope that they would devour him, along with that wretched woman and squealing son he causes family. To my lawyer, James Jerome Sadler, I pass on whatever illness has rotted my mind and soul away so that he can feel just as empty and useless as he was to me and to any other parasites that come crawling out of the woodwork. I leave nothing to hell with you all. Finally, to my beloved daughter, I leave all my earthly possessions for what they're worth. I hope they will inspire you to realize your true potential, that final most precious gift, however, is not mine to give. You will have to discover that on your own. I believe in you, as I always have. Father, I still think you're insane. Oh, well, okay, I'm in your office. Everything is so big. Oh, father or mother? You know what, father? I forgive nothing. I'm going towards my mother. Hi, mom. How you doing? Oh, I had to pick a door. Well, going for our mother. Mother! Mother, are you here? Father is most likely drinking again. I wouldn't know. I am not dealing with him. 
Oh. Hey there. Mother? Oh, come on. Don't be afraid. It won't bite. Are you sure? Where are you, mother? Here. Try for yourself. Try what for myself? Mother? Mother, what are you telling me to try for myself? I find myself concerned. Is there somewhere in particular I'm supposed to be going? Um, oh, piano! Oh, try the... Oh, it's a step stool. I see. Oh, I can play piano with you, mother. Uh, uh, if you got an easier symphony, how about chopsticks? I can play chopsticks with you, mother. No, no, that, that's not quite right. Wait, wait, am I actually supposed to know the, the, how to play the tune? Um, mother, this is highly complicated. This is very much beyond my expertise as a potential three-year-old. Huh, still not quite there. Uh, hi. Mother, can you help me then? If I don't know how to play it, can, can you please show me? Can you teach me how to play it? Oh! I was trying to learn to play, father. You bully. You know what? No, I'm going to continue to play. Curse you, father. Nope, you did not. You know what? I have an idea. Go get your crayons. Oh, fun! Where, where do I find crayons? I found booze. Do booze count as crayons? I found fire. I found a box. Mother, I'm really gonna need some help on where these crayons might be located. Oh, you know what? No, I need no help. I discovered it all on my own. I am a very adept three-year-old. I've done it. And crayons. Ah, oh, thank you, mother. Okay, square, circle, heart. Square. No! No? Can't you see the colors? No, I can't. I'm blind. Leave me. Square, circle. Okay, square, circle, heart. Square, circle, heart, square, circle, triangle. I can see. I'm doing it. Mother, you're proud of me. Are you ever so proud of me, mother? I'm playing the piano. Yes. Triangle, circle, and thing. Wait, that one. And then this one. That's actually not bad. Well, I didn't play it for you, father. You, young lady. It looks like talent runs in the family. Hmm. I played that for you, mother. Aren't you ever so proud of me? Um, mother, mother, piano broke gravity. Uh, is this gonna be an issue? Am I gonna get in trouble for breaking the gravity? Yeah, I can't play any more piano. Is that actually achieve something? Or do you just want me to leave now? Uh, I suppose I can leave. Bye bye piano. I played such a good song, did I not? Is everything okay? I'm incredibly short and dangerous and incredible dog. Dog, I love you, but missed you. Well, at least it's nice to know you're alive, I suppose. Farewell, pup. Oh. Oh, I don't remember being like this. Things are broken. I didn't do it. You can't blame me. I'm a tiny child of possibly three years old. I can't- I'm not even torn them to see inside the drawers! Right. Okay, probably should I should just, you know, leave. I should get out of the destruction. Hey, Mother, I found your wheelchair. Do we know where that mother is? She kind of abandoned me after I figured out the piano. Oh, there you are, Mother. And, oh. Piano's gone and tall again. Oh no. Hello, how you doing? I see you brought a symphony on your painting. I think Father might be mighty displeased about that. Um. Uh, oh, do I have to finish both routes? So now do I need to go to the Father's? Probably, right? Tiny child! Is that me? Ow! I can't follow the tiny child, which I presume is me. We'll go this way instead. X marks the spot, huh? Do I need to drill to the other side? I'm very good at doing that, you know. 
Hmm. Just gonna squeeze on by here. There we go. I found. Oh, I found myself. Oh, I'm running at myself. No. Oh. Baby got hit by an invisible train. Oh, no. That baby's definitely in pieces. And that's unfortunate. What? Oh, okay. We should probably leave. We should probably get out of here. Yeah, you know what, father? No, no, don't need to see you. Not that interested. Goodbye, father. Oh. Oh, I see. I'm not giving you a choice, I see, okay? Listen, father. You're certifiably insane. How about you don't murder me brutally? What? We all are a cheating comet. Commodore? Huh. Well, that's new. Oh, that's flames. That's not only new, that's a bit of an issue. Oh. And this is the death of Mika. She died brutally in a flaming wall. Oh, hello, horse. Are you get. Oh! Did I just hit the wall? Did you have to hit me in the face? Hey. Ow! Oh, hey, princess. I didn't know you were out here. No, no, it's all right. Daddy just tripped. You know, clumsy old thing, right? Mm hmm. Oh, sure, there, father. There. You don't need to worry. Daddy's just tired. So very tired. Well, I mean, Daddy, you're also very, very drunk, most likely. And I am in the bowels of the house again. I remember this being a lot smaller. And I remember me being a lot bigger as well. Mother, is that you? Oh, paintings got destroyed. Bye, mother. Anything else here I need? Oh, now I got hit in the face. Hey, there's my train again. Can't look at this one, though. We shall keep going. Oh, I, I don't remember being this small ever in my life. I am denying it to the day I die. I was never this tiny. Can't even see over the tables. Okay. We can... Oh, we can still spin the globes. I still maintain there's booze hiding inside there. Ooh, what have I found? Hey, it's one third of the photo. Is that what I'm looking for now? I'm looking for the photo pieces. And it's so very, very dark. Hello? Mother? Or is that father? I don't know. I didn't get a good look before you just started to disappear. Okay, down into the basement I can go. Where's the worst that can happen down here? These door frames are so incredibly large. Did you loop me? I think you- oh. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, it's pulsating. Remarkably concerning, but so very, very pretty. Tiny child? Tiny child, that was once me. Oh, there's a ball. I can't kick it back to you. I'm afraid I tried. And mother... Yes, mother was hiding part of the picture. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave before I accidentally burn myself. Father, are you... Oh! Oh! So someone dropped that. Um, mother? Mother, someone dropped the chandelier. I know nothing about it. I was not even there. Nope, nope. I... I just saw it in a vision. Yep, that's it. I have nothing to do with it. Okay. Mother, I shall find your last portion of the photo. And then you shall be whole again, Mother. Won't you be ever so pleased then? Someone stabbed the globe. You heathen! Oh, and someone started a fire. That's even worse. See, this is the problem with dropping the chandelier. To start fires and the tiny child is likely the one that's going to end up dying. Even though I know for a fact I'm alive. Oh, what is this? Oh, yes! Push it over! We put out the fire! You're well- Oh, that is what I needed! Can I have this? I can! Thank you! Mother, aren't you ever so pleased with me? I have the entire portrait! I mean, I, I don't know what to precisely do with it, but I have it, so it's mine now! Fairly well. I'll just go downstairs again. I'm sure I shall loop back round. 
in there. Does anyone have three portions of a photo? And I have collected them all ever so diligently. Ever so diligently. Is that the word? Diligently? It was one of those words. Hello? Who, um. Oh, I can go this way, I see. Hey, it's my dog! Oh, he's so adorable. I love you already, buddy. Father, I despise the fact that I'm pretty sure you killed our dog. Hmm. Okay, so who wants mother's photo? Clearly someone does. Nope, nothing in here. Okay, can I... I can't even get past you. This is the end of the line. Well, is it? Yep, yep, it pretty much is. I... What do I even want that? Do you want me to go inside? It doesn't seem to do anything. Okay, I can just go back the way I came. That's no problem. Can I just leave again? Is leaving again a good idea? Hmm. Is everything okay up here? No. I am returning once more because I didn't particularly find anything down there. Okay. okay, no, this is all how I left it. Maybe I was just supposed to keep going back? No. I'm trying to escape from the deep dark pit of fire. I've collected mother's photo. Aha, and the door is here. Can I actually get through the door? That is the big question. I can. I've done a good thing. Oh, hey there, young lady. Shouldn't you be in bed? It's all right, you can stay. Just don't make too much noise. Daddy's working. What do you mean, who's that? It's mommy. What? That's not what mommy looks like? Well, she does to me. Let me guess. We only know Mummy with her scars, right? Jesus, Daddy. Okay. Hey, it's back to the colours. Well, I'm leaving again. Hi. Is there anything else I need to particularly do? I mean, I visited mummy and I visited daddy. Can I just go back the way I came? Nope, that's locked. Okay, so back to mummy's area, maybe? Oh! It's wet again. Where are we now? Oh, well, I do enjoy climbing, so... Let's go on an adventure. Hi, tiny doll. That was creepy. Okay, I need to get up, right? Push this over. So I can now step up. I figured it out. Are you dropping books on me again? Oh, I found a cake. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. I told you I was three. Happy birthday, dear. Do you forget my name? What kind of parents are you? I am outlashed. Not even that's not even the correct word, and I know it. And it's such a scandal. You can't even name me. Okay, pull out these. We need steps. Oh! Stop pouting me with apples. I'm just trying to climb. Heathens! That's what you all are. Okay. Oh! What? Did you just throw knives at me or something? Oh. Oh, we've lost our floor. That's a bit of an issue. It's fine. I can, I, I'm can. i apparently a spectacular climber. Yes, I'm coming. Thank you for showing me the way, tiny creepy doll. Uh, hey, it's my other birthday cake. How old am I this time? I'm five! Are you out of your mind? What? You said there was gonna be a party. I just started a bit early. 
Whoops. Father, you don't drink booze at a five-year-old's party. Shame on you, father. Oh, wh why am I slipping? I don't know. I should get out of here. Oh! It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I am a spectacular five-year-old climber. I cannot be stopped. How do I get... Oh, there it is. Down you go. Ow. You had to risk that to do so I have to go all the way back. Uh, do you... Oh, there's a problem. I'm beginning to think I probably shouldn't be here. This is going to mean my death. I know it. Okay, does anything else want to drop on me? I'm pretty sure you will. Okay, it's fine, it's fine. We've got this. We can go. We can... Tiny doll, I swear, if you push me off. Oh, that's what I thought. Okay. How many is this? Four. Oh, I'm eight. This one's gonna be perfect. Is it? It has to be. I'm gonna prove you wrong. All of you. What? Not not now, Princess. Go play with your dolls or your crayons. Daddy's very busy. Hmm, I forget you, father. You absolute drunk. Oh. Okay, this is cheered up again. Hello! Oh, everything is growing. Everything is growing but me! Okay. Oh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna escape. Oh, you big wolf. Do I wanna go that way? I could just turn back. You know what? Maybe we don't wanna deal with the big wolf today. Well, you know what? We could just leave. We, we could quite literally just go home. We could not quite literally just go home. We've gotta go face the big wolf. Well, you know what, father? I think I can take you. Merely because you're already dead. And lead me through. Thank you. Oh, I dropped. Oh! There I am. Are you going to run into a wall again? I'm not going to lie, that was remarkably funny. What? What is going on? Wait. Oh. The dying child. Wait, no, Popo! But you love us, don't you? You're not gonna hurt us. Well, you know you're my best friend. You're not gonna hurt me. You're not gonna hurt me, man. Right? Oh, you're gonna hurt me. I think the dog hurt us. What the hell did you do? Oh, you didn't mean to. Well, that makes it all better, doesn't it? It'll just magically unbreak because you didn't mean to. Go on, get out of here. Go to your room and break shit in there. Just take all your toys and smash them one by one. And keep at it. Maybe you'll finally get good at something. Well, screw you too, father. Just because I dropped one of your pesky buttons of booze. You know what? I'm out of here. Yeah, I don't need you. I don't need any of you. This is a fireplace. Okay, maybe I need you to show me the door. There we go. Okay, there it is. And I'm leaving. You enjoy licking up the booze from the carpet. Ooh, colours? Or this door. Ooh, interesting. Hello. Missing cat. Mr. Scooter reward. All my dollies. Contact at. I'm guessing we never find the cat if we've still got all the dollies, huh? Can I climb up? I don't think I can, right? Poor Mr. K Scooter. Hmm. It's fine, I'm good to escape now. Down into my colourful abode. Well, it's no longer my colourful abode. Hey, Mr. Cat! There you are. Okay, I need to find your wheel. That's what I need to find. Don't worry, I'm going to fix you. Clearly, this is a good place to be going. I can go do my climbing adventures again. Hi, I'm looking for my cat's wheel. Has anyone seen it? This is very unstable. What, you... what is this? Oh! What did I do? Seems bad, most likely. Are they eyeballs? I don't know. I think I shall leave it. Why? 
I was kind of expecting the wheel to be here. I'm a little bit surprised it's not. W what do I benefit from coming here for? Oh, okay. I, I mean, does that do anything? I don't know. I have a gear. So I'm guessing I have to take the lid to replace the gear, right? Now I'm just gonna... Maybe my cat needs the gear. Cat? Kids, do you need another gear? I don't know what for, but uh, you might be useful to you. Come on, Mr. Scooter. Do you need this? Oh, you... Oh, okay, I understand. Use the gear instead of a wheel. Oh! Oh, it broke. Don't even know where it went. Oh, God. Find sink house. Don't worry. Ow! Did I just get hit in the face? Did you just kick me, whoever you are? Did I just get murdered? I think I might have. Huh. Well, okay. Yeah, I know. I'm looking for your wheel. It's just remotely hard to find anything. It's very, very dark. And I have no source of light. Hmm, is there anything else I can use? Because clearly the gear didn't work. Well, uh, I would say just use the lid. The problem is I don't think I can take it back. I've already placed it and I can't replace it with the gear anymore. Hmm. Oh, I can just take it, never mind. Oh, I see, it was one or the other. Okay, it's fine. We're gonna try this instead. My brother might be a little bit displeased that we broke the clock for no reason, but never mind. Okay, try this instead. Here we go. Does this work for you? Yes? No? That's a no. Yeah. Well, I don't know what you want then. I can't find your wheel. What would you want me to do? I can't find it. Hmm, okay. Where do I even find the last attempt at things? Is anyone... Is, oh, there it is! How do I get that? Can I move one of the planks? It scares me, I'm just trying to... Can I, can I move you? I don't think I can. I need something to get up there. Hmm. What to do? That is the big question. Wait. The sink in my mind. Ow! I may have fallen. Never mind. Okay, got a happy picture. Can I move a chair? Doesn't seem to be. That's fine. I know what I've got to do. It's just, you know, doing it. Scares me. Oh, oh! I'm a little bit closer, but I'm still not close enough. Oh! Apparently that was close enough. Uh, I've got, I need. I need to grab it before I die. I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna get out of there before I get murdered. There we go. I found your wheel. Rejoice. Off you go, Mr. Cat. I shall follow behind you, and then maybe I won't get kicked in the face by whatever's hiding down there. Yeah, man, I'm right behind you. You're sick. You're insane. You You're are. Thinking straight. Oh, hello. Who are you? You're right. I am sick. Oh, is this mother? I'm sick of you not being there for us. We need you. I need you. When was the last time you slept with me? Christ, when was the last time you even touched me? Do you know what that does to me? To know that my own husband is disgusted with me. Oh! Ow! Booze! Excuse me if my oh, gosh. is working my ass off trying to provide for this family. Oh, but this no, is not going good. You're right. It's much more important to whisper sweet nothings in your ear. You, you call that work? You, you lock yourself in there for hours, days. You, you come out looking like shit, stinking of booze and stale piss. Oh, hi guys. 
Thank you for getting me food there, Mr. Cat. Hi, Mom. You've returned once more. Are you pleased? What? Oh, that... That's all right, honey. Something got into Mommy's eye, that's all. You be a good little girl and go to sleep. Okay, Mommy. I shall Daddy's try. Daddy's working, so... We can't disturb him. Mommy has to go downstairs and take a bath. Wait, is I this the you. day she died? Oh, that's traumatic. More than a wife, she was first and foremost his muse. Her beauty and talent drove him. After the accident, she became a burden. A disgusting monster screeching out from her bed. An anchor weighing him down. That is quite barbaric, father. I mean, yeah, it's actually, he did seem more bothered by her accent than we know. But then again, we didn't really hear what she thought about the scars after the accident. But he was definitely displeased with them. Ah, yes. We found the Hall of Photos once more. Hello, Mother. I remember you well. I think. Is there a mim anything being triggered in this room? Is there, do I need to look at one particular photo? No? Okay, guess this one I can just leave straight away. Understood. My nice childhood room. At least my... What, bed prison is gone. Why is that one so blurry? Oh, I remember this room. Alright, young lady. Shall we continue? Nope, I'm leaving. Right. Whatever happens, just keep looking at me nope. and listen. Not doing it. Refuse. I'm displeased with you, father. Gonna I'm gonna look at Mr. Bear over there, that's what I'm gonna look at. Nope. Bear only. Can I leave it? I don't want to be painted. I just want to go play my bears. Is there anything else I'm actually supposed to be doing? Do I have to look at him? Now, where was he? No. Ah, yes. Nope. The princess was all alone. <clears throat> nope. Not doing it. Princess. Nope. Keep looking at me. Make me. Look at me. No. Nope. I refuse. This is my childhood rebellion. Do you want this story to have a happy ending or not? No, oh, no. God damn it. Not again. Fine. Because the princess wouldn't stop fidgeting, she was set upon by the evil witch's minion and dragged off into the darkness, never to be seen again. The end. Wow, father. You have no patience for tiny child. My fault. It was always my fault. All I had to do was stay still, day after day, for hours on end, until he would finally get it right. I've lost count of how many attempts there were, but each one made me feel like I was his greatest failure. I'm not gonna lie, I actually like that picture. It was very creepy. And I'm sorry, I am potentially three years old. What makes you think I have any capabilities of sitting still? It's just, are we sure there's nothing in here for me to... No? Okay, well, I've explored there, so I'm assuming there's nothing for me to collect. Any other rooms before I go back down? I'm pretty sure. Okay. So now we've still got the father's paint room to explore, right? Oh, the bedroom! And which photo is this? Oh, father burning, maybe? Is that? Well, there's someone burning with green toxicity and someone crying in the cupboard. I'm guessing the crying in the cupboard is me, huh? Huh. I don't remember that being there. Wait, wait, what's that? That what? I can hear you out there. Please, please help me. It hurts. Mother? Oh, it hurts so much. I can't take it anymore. Mother, is that you? I would help you, but I don't know how. Why oh. won't you help me? Oh, you're just like your father. Oh, I didn't you mean to. I didn't know that was a me. thing. You probably wish I was dead. I didn't know that was you, Mother. And sorry. 
I was trying to help you, believe it or not. I just apparently I wasn't very good at it. Hey, found this leg is here. Well, that's been kind of beat up. Big Mother's not very happy with me. And you know what? I'm starting to think Mother wasn't a very nice person either. Getting aggressive at me? I'm a child. Ooh, child next to a big scary door. I'm assuming it's this one. Oh. What room is this? Interesting. So I think that's all the ones up here, right? And down we go once more. I've not found any keys anywhere, so I'm assuming I just can't get inside there. Now... Oh, down into the basement we can go! The Where's the light switch gone? The light switch does not exist anymore! <gasps> oh, well, that's why I've got candles, apparently. Thank you for informing me of that detail. Wait, I want the letter. I see the letter! Dear Mr. and Mrs. Kirkstein, I once again implore you to give me back my daughter. Give her back. Give her back, give her back, give her back, give her back, give her back. With best regards. You know what? Something's telling me that that's not going to convince anyone to give you back your daughter, sir. In fact, quite the opposite, I would assume. Mother! Hello! Are you feeling better? What is that? Hi, Mom. Uh, yes, that's it. Where you at? What just happened? Okay, well, I think I saw my mother. No, there's in the wheelchair. Oh, and I'm being forced to play the piano. Well, I don't seem very happy about it. Mother, are you as bad as father? Should I not be putting you on a pedestal? I mean, I thought you were the nice one, Mother, but uh, maybe not. Then again, you were getting rather annoyed with me when you were trying to teach me the piano. Is there anything here? Oh! A tiny pocket watch. And I think there's a tiny child me, right? Ooh. My beloved, I've been thinking about what happened. I've been trying to understand. My dear, help me. I just don't understand. Why would you do it? Did you feel like there was no other way? Tell me, goddammit. What did I do to deserve this? I did my best. You know I did. I gave you everything. Well, I'm guessing that was from our father, right? Further to our mother. So... He is clearly still not doing well, huh? They have bottles of booze. Okay, so is this the last room we need to go into? Oh uh, yes. Father's painting studio. I wonder when was the last I time this place it saw well. I don't think it's ever saw sunlight. <laughs> well, I mean that's a lie, but still. Oh. What have you found here? Oh, paint. Interesting. Oh, hello. Okay. You know what, Father? You probably want me to use the paint, right? But nope. I'm gonna continue with my crayons. What are you doing? Put that down. Make me. You're much too old for that childish nonsense. Yeah? Uh, jokes on you. I'm gonna do it to spite you now. See? Look how beautiful my entire environment is. All made out of crayons. Go this way? I can go this way. Okay, this this is looking a bit more boggy. Oh, I found there. Tell us, that's a puppet show. Play me a show. Yes, I'm sitting and raptured. Oh, you've got quite the audience. Hello, friends. What have you got for us? Oh, Little Red Riding Hood. The little girl in red was walking through the woods when suddenly, out of nowhere, jumped out. You know who? Eyes glowing bloody red, teeth sharp as razors, and yet the big bad wolf did not seem to faze her. Be careful, little girl, the big bad wolf sneered. You're in fantasy land, where things ain't what they seem. Oh, shush, you big old meanie. 
the frightened girl exclaimed. You're the only threat in this wonderful land. With my magic crayons, I can do no harm. I can make the trees yellow, turn them upside down, turn grass into candy, make the sky go red. I can do whatever pops into my head. The wolf was unimpressed with his show of skill. You do have the power to do what you will. Alas, I humbly urge you to practice restraint, for you are responsible for what you create. You're nasty, jealous, and mean, said the little girl. I just want to have fun, and you want me to learn. I wish a big old rock would fall down from the sky and crush your big bad mouth into a minced meat pie. Don't do it, I beg you, the big wolf cried. You lack scale and perspective, my sweet little child. But it was too late. His warning fell on deaf ears. Down came the rock and smashed them all to smithereens. Ah, you're right. The child did lack perspective and uh, scale. And now everyone's dead. Such a shame. Such a sad, sad tale. Okay, do I just return home now? Maybe? Oh, there's a path. Okay, so I just followed it, so do I just follow the path back? Yeah, I would presume so. Ooh, are you gonna take me back to my canvas? You are. I made a horse! Delightful. I'm not taking the paintbrush. I refuse. Ooh, what is this? Yes, light my path some more. Thank you. I shall go this way. Just where would you like to lead me to? Yeah, I'm good enough in Boulder. Could I drop that one as well? Oh, danger! I laugh in the face of danger. Oh, let me out! Creativity is not a toy, it's a gift! Do you want to squander it like all those careless brats out there? Yes, yes I do. I wonder if there's actually a snake out here. Oh, there is! What is this? Is this the snake's den? Oh, I should get out of here. I found the snake and the snake wishes to kill me. I'm just gonna return big to my canvas with my beautiful crayon. Uh -huh, father is gonna be so displeased. I regret nothing. Father? Uh, uh, did you cut my horse up? You murdered my horse again. I warned you time and time again. I won't let you waste time in these mindless doodles. This is for your own good. Mate, what's for my own good, huh? Hey, there's a sword. My, oh, I made the powerful one. No, am I the purest of them all? I don't think I am. I cannot get the sword out. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, okay, we're gonna follow the bird path. The path of the bird. I will follow you this one time. I don't. I think I like you though still. That's still screaming death, so maybe yeah we should just go this way. That sounds like a snake. That is the snake! And oh, hello? I've been blocked. Oh yeah, just I just need that photo. You see it? It's right there. Oh! Trey! Trey, you've destroyed some of my very beautiful trees. How how far do you go? Can I can I still get past you? I can! Yes! Thank you. I swear, if you get me eaten by the snake, I am going to be so displeased with you, Train. Hello, okay, I'm right, and the photo is mine. Yes, Daddy's alone with his painting, and we're happy with Mummy. There we go. So do I just need to keep going down this path? Is there anyone else for me to go? Hello? That's, that seems kind of like out of bounds. Is there like another crayon or something, do we think? Hmm. See, I don't want to use the paintbrush because that's... might end up doing what we're doing here. So maybe I have to use the paintbrush now? There's a snake! Don't know where the snake went, but uh, it was a snake. Maybe I need to go down to the danger path instead. No, I'm trying to get back onto my path. Hmm. 
Okay, so we might as well go have a look. So this was one path we've done. I don't know where the snake went. I think it's gone over there. Okay, so we're also just going to be nosing down this path now. This path ends instantly. Well, maybe I just need to keep going. Oh, hello. What are you? Your dad took it. Wait, I found the sword. I just... I mean, do, do I need to follow the maze to get to it? Because I have already found the sword. I know exactly where it is. Should I be walking around in the dark? I can't imagine this is the brightest idea I've had. Not with a snake slithering around somewhere. Okay, I think I'm safe. I'm back to the sword. Can I, can I now have you? No? And it didn't work. Okay, is there anywhere else I can go explore? Ooh. Is this somewhere new or have I been here before? Good bit if I've had this sparkly path. Go this way, okay, as you say. Oh, it's just this thing. I've definitely been here before. Are you just going to play the same show for me? Or is it a different one? Hello? It seems like the same one. The little girl in red came upon a crossroads. Wait, is it different? There, she stopped and wondered. Oh, it is different. Where should I go? Up jumped the wolf and gave the poor girl a fright. Do not be afraid. I'm not gonna bite. Lies. One of these paths with danger is fraught, while the other one, most assuredly, is not. The little girl in red took a shortcut she knew through a lovely field of corn, all covered in dew. But the field grew dark and full of despair. An eerie sense of dread filled the morning air. The girl heard the wolf yelling from afar. You have chosen poorly. You will not get far. Had you only learned how shadow and light intertwined on canvas, you could have chosen right. The little girl in red ran as fast as she could, her flowing dark hair tucked under her hood. But she quickly got tired worn out by her flight and succumbed to the darkness never to see the light well that's unfortunate apparently I died in the end of this story and it all went up in flames well you know what father no nope. I'm sticking with my crayons if I could actually find another one I, mean, I don't know if I need to find another one Okay, anything else changed? I found that. See, only the paintbrush is here. I don't want to use the paintbrush. So, I, have I, I've been down this one though. Oh, maybe not. I think a second one's opened up to me, right? Don't remember this path. Okay, we continue to go explore down here. I refuse to use your paintbrush. I refuse to learn the power of the light and the shadows and all the other art things you wish me to learn. Right, mainly because you're the one trying to make me light up. Oh, I'm in a treehouse now. Delightful. We've got all our horses. Oh, okay, that's an issue. Why is roaming around in my... Oh, it's just me. Hello. Hello, tiny child. Many tiny children. Are you guys okay? I mean, this this house is mine. I don't share. Oh. Oh no. Or is it just me or is there a uh, murderous nutcracker? Oh no! Woodcracker! You've just broken my lap. Don't you dare. Don't even think about it, nutcracker. Don't. I'm warning you now. No, 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 no. Oh, you heathen! You monster! Oh, abs, I'm gonna stick with crayons for life now. It's gonna be all your fault. Come on, drop an apple on him. No. Oh, curses. Oh, now you're just going mental. You're gonna knock me out of this tree. I hope you get crushed by the tree. Okay, 
Well, actually, I think I've survived. Oh, and there's my crayon. And you know what, Nutcracker? This is all your fault. I mean, I was going to pick it up anyway, but still. Are you trying to annoy me? Yes. This is not what I've taught you. I know. I'm finding myself remarkably displeased with you, father. And this is your punishment. You do not get to have a child artist protege. Pamish, father. Aw, I killed the birds. Delightful. What? You think I'm enjoying this? Yes. You think I'm doing this out of spite? Yes. Get it right next time and I won't have to fix it for you. You know, Neat, don't be such an art fixer. No one likes an art fixer. Okay. Oh! I just went that way, so maybe this way now? God knows what this animal's gonna be. Hey, it's part of our train again. Hello, I'm here, and I found a jack in the box. Yes, come on, play me a tune. Dun, 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 ba, ba, da. Oh, hello. I, I'm just, I, so I'm just gonna take the crayon. Purpose, aren't you? Yes, are you only just realizing that? I mean, I would have thought you were realizing that when I deliberately walked away from the paintbrush the last three or four times. Uh, and now I'm gonna deliberately run away from the giant snake that's most likely wanting to eat me. Oh, curse you, wolf! Go get eaten by the snake! Oh, okay, that, I got really close to it that time. Lou! Father, what did you do? Why'd you paint a giant eyeball on my trees? There! I hope you're satisfied with yourself. Stop crying! We'll pick this up tomorrow, and I swear to God, I better start seeing some progress! Looking back? I don't think my father ever really wanted a child. <laughs> it's no wonder I was never truly allowed to be one. No, no, what he wanted, above all things, was a successor. Someone to carry on his legacy. Anything else was just a distraction. I mean, seriously, how old was I when I drew on this? Why do you think I'd have accurate proportions? Ooh, okay. Hey, the tree, that's the locked door at the top, right? Okay, I can go there. What's this first? Dear sir, in my line of work, one becomes used to receiving all kinds of correspondence. Obsessive letters from failed authors. Threats from offended readers. I guess you can say it comes with the territory. However, never in my 20 years of running a publishing house have I read anything quite like your recent letters. While well, I always tried to keep my composure, in light of your continuous and increasingly enthusiastic output, I find it exceedingly difficult to reply in a civilized manner. Hence, let me be painfully clear, we at Marshall and Waters take pride in our numerous publications, especially our acclaimed encyclopedias. Our staff of esteemed academics work tirelessly to provide our readers with the most up-to-date information and include the latest scientific data. Unfortunately, your findings have nothing to do with real science and the visual references you have provided, although impressive from a purely artistic standpoint, are not proof of anything. Honestly, your continuous attempts at redefining the rat and exposing its true vile nature have turned from being simply tiresome to deeply disturbing. If this was some misguided attempt at performance art, then I must say I find it in very poor taste. If, however, you were being serious, I humbly advise you to seek professional help. In either case, I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you. Regards, Charles Joseph Marshall, Marshall and Waters Publishing. Huh, we're still obsessed with the rat, huh? Wait, what's it saying? Needed a jar. Mm. Well, the good news is none of um, the samples remain on the shelf. Probably for the best. Now, let's go see what this door has for us, huh? Okay, well, actually, it's so much easier to get up the stairs now. Now, it was this one, yes? I remember this door. Mainly because I tried to get through it ten minutes ago. Oh, I'm in now. And... So, 
After all this time, after all I've been through. Stay here. Your mother and I need to talk. This is all you have for me? And of all places, you chose this room. You think I don't hear that? Stop crying! Don't make me come in there! So many memories. This... this one room filled with more memories than I can count. Wait, did he just lock us in this room? Oh... And we get to do that then. I imagined him standing there, all smug and pleased with himself, thinking this piece of canvas was somehow going to fix everything. I imagined what I would say to him, what I would do. My daddy. You shouldn't have. You really? Oh, we are. Yeah, yeah, we are really mad still. Where did you expect, father? Wait, is that fire? Maybe I should get out of this house. Oh, I should definitely get out of this house. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm going to die. I think I died. Okay. Well, I'm guessing that is, um, there's the ending where we just curse our father, right? He gets no forgiveness from us. And I know there's three endings again, so next time, yes, we shall choose the forgiveness endings. We shall choose the paintbrush, don't worry. Okay, so now we're onto the father storyline, where we forgive him for everything, and we do as he says, so we look at him while he's painting all that. So now... Yes, we shall pick the paintbrush just as you want, Father. Oh, the summer trees. So green and vibrant and full of life. Thank you, Father. But also young and experienced. Let's try to find them a more poignant season. Where they are wiser and have some stories to tell. Okay, so... I'm guessing we're looking for paint? Brilliant! Yes, we Let's are! Let's add some more of the same color! That won't make it boring or predictable. Oh. Oh, okay. No, he doesn't want us to add green, I see. So he wants us more poignant. Okay, we're gonna look for colors. Oh, I messed up already. I'm sorry, father. I didn't mean to mess up. I uh, I just saw paint and I, I tried to add it. Okay, so... What colors do you think he wants? Maybe an orange? Maybe we can make it autumn? I need paint that's not green, please. Um, I'll leave a little alone to you, that's fine. Hi, Bab, you said any colors. I need paints. Oh, what is this one? Oh, okay, this one might. Dog, not now. What about this? Oh, they sway in the breeze, but are none the wiser. Just like you. Huh? What am I doing wrong? Am I not- am, is this not what you want? I'm adding colors! What colors do you want? You're gonna need to be a bit more specific. I don't know about art. I don't do paintings. Oh no. Okay, see? Red! Red! Everyone loves red. Red is the, probably the good color to go, right, Father? Oh no. Why are you making art so stressful? Okay, red. Ah, yes! The autumn of life. Okay, there we when go. When man seeks shelter from the elements. Let's see how our little hut fares when the skies grow dark. Okay, skies grow dark. I understand. No, I don't need a crayon. Crayon is going to make him so mad at me. Skies grow dark. We need a dark color. That's what we need. Hi. Has anyone got any dark paints? I, I, I don't know what color is this. Is this black? I think it might be. Um... I'm gonna assume this is black paint, maybe? I mean, either black or a very dark blue. I don't have either of those. Oh. Hello. Where? Oh, there's a dog. Oh. You could have squished me! Oh, thank you. Why are you like this? I am just being abused. 
Can you stop getting close to me? I don't wish to die. Hello, what color paint have you got? Hi, cat. Wait, wait, oh, I, I, need, I need the colors. How do I get up to you? Can you help me? I really want that paint. Bear, bear or head? No? Is there anything I can interact with? Hmm. Doesn't seem to be. And I see it's calm beach. I see it then, that's clearly the one I need. Is there anything I can use to reach it? Hi, hi. Does this ball need to be anywhere? <gasps> nope, I can't. Can I push the ball away to the top, do you think? Come on, we can do this. We can. Oh, is it, is it just me or is it getting bigger? It, it kind of feels like it's getting bigger. Come on, keep going, keep pushing! We're nearly there, we're doing so well! Yes! Oh, this seems like a mammoth task! I swear to god, if I'm not supposed to be doing this, I'm gonna be so upset. I don't think it's going in the right direction! <laughs> no, you just need to go forwards! Oh, oh no. Come on, I'm nearly there, I think! I think I'm nearly there. Oh no, 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 don't you dare fall down! I swear to god, Ball, how big are you now? Oh, curses. Oh! Yes? Yes, I did the correct thing. And this is clearly the color I want. Yes? And it was that black? I'm pretty sure it was. Well, it's mine now, so I'm going to go and take it. Okay, so hopefully this is the right color. Father, I found a paint. I'm sure you're going to be very happy with me when I actually find my way out of here. Just give me a minute. I'm nearly there. Okay. And now. Paint? You yeah. see? In the end, all we take for granted is fragile and temporary. Aww. Man passes while nature endures. Speaking of which, I don't think our proud stallion likes the weather. Let's brighten things up a bit. Okay, so brighten things up. So I need a light color. Okay, so maybe that blue I found earlier, which you yelled at me for? Oh, uh, he doesn't want green. I uh, know he doesn't want him green, because he yelled at me for green. Pink is going to be a bad idea. Will that dog actually hurt me, do you think? I I'm getting the feeling it probably can. Okay. No! Pop out, stop! Uh, so there we go. Bye. Oh! Hi, Pop. Okay, probably best if I just follow the same direction as you. Hopefully that you uh, just do a circuit. Maybe you're not faster than me. You don't catch up. What's this? There's nothing here I need. You lied to me. Why, oh, you put a nice little box there thinking it'd be something I needed, but no. It was all an illusion. Ow. Okay. Uh, is things okay? Things seem to be okay. I mean, do I want to go back inside? I mean, everything is burning, which is a bit of an issue. Nope, the- Oh, the fire is gone. Hmm. Okay, now I'm still looking for my light paints. Have you seen them, Bear? I can't remember where I had them. Oh, there. Ah, I can't reach them. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I know how to get it. I'm going to go back outside and grab that- Wait, Where's the door gone? Ah, there it is. Thank you. I don't remember it being by the pink, but never mind. Okay. It's burning again, as it probably should be. Oh, let's hope it's not burning my canvas, because I've only just found the yellow. And that is clearly what you want, yes? Oh, I've been locked in this way. I see how it is. Back I go. Hey. I mean, I mean, I would love to go through here, but um, flames say no. Is there another door frame I can use? Please? I need to get back to my canvas. It is of utmost importance that I make father extremely happy. And to do so, I uh, need to go at the sun. Oh, here it is. What? Game, you're cheating me. I'm being abused by you, game. What, and now it's a dead end. How do I get back inside? You just don't want me to have the yellow, do you? What is your problem with yellow? Yellow's a nice color. It brightens up the sky, as father said. 
I can't get in here. I'm gonna force my way in. Oh. Oh, that was the answer to the solution. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be death, to be perfectly honest. Now. How do I force my way back to the canvas? That's what I need to know. Because, I mean, I can see the green paint. I don't need the green paint. I just I can't see how to get inside. Okay. Oh, the pink again. Delightful. Here we go. I've done it. I'm one step closer, I think. I'm absolutely all the steps closer. I found my canvas. And here's That's the right. yellow. The sun bestows its kind rays upon the land. Uh, it's getting warmer and warmer uh, until finally, marvelous, isn't it? Yeah. I know it seems like a tragedy. Yeah. But a beautiful tragedy okay. is always better than an unremarkable existence. Uh, if you insist. Oh. Oh, that was pretty. In his own way, I believe he meant well. He wanted me to excel, hoping that when the time came, I would succeed where he failed. Avoid his mistakes. God knows he made plenty of those. Oh! Yes, and now we go to the room. Huh. You know, I'm pretty sure that is for the other endings, right? You've got to actually line them up correctly. So we're not going to do that now. We're going to go get the base ending for this run. Then we shall redo this and put them in order. Is that chair always there? You know what? I don't recall. Either way, off we go now. It's time to go visit our old room once more. We have words for our father. Father, I have returned once more. I don't know what I expected to find. A farewell note? A final will? What I found was an apology. Expressed in the only language he ever truly knew. At that moment, I could finally see my father for what he was. A man driven insane with sadness and guilt. Trapped in this house. A nightmarish echo chamber of past mistakes and tragedies. It was this house. A place beyond hope, beyond redemption. I knew what I had to do. Wait, so we burn the house. Do we burn it in the other one as well? Just we burn it and accidentally trap ourselves instead of getting out. Trying to understand my father a long time ago. But I could finally forgive him. I would say I feel bad for the house, but it was kind of driving me insane a little bit. With all these disappearing hallways. Well, but at least the baby lord survived, I suppose. Nope, no, nope, the baby lord does not survive. You know what? Probably for the best. Hey, princess. What have you got there? Oh, that's so lovely, sweetie. But why pink? Oh no. We were doomed to repeat our father's mistakes, apparently. And now, let's go get the last ending. Okay, we're back. And now, we should have all nine photos. We do! So now I just need to make this drawing. Okay, so I see eyeballs, so you're clearly gonna be the center of the face, right? Where's the other part of the eyes? Oh, you're right there, okay? Uh, you are- no, nope. oh, I don't wanna move you! 
Curses, I didn't want to do that. Okay, you are oh, the corner piece. Where's the uh, side of the hat, maybe? I just moved the other corner piece, okay. And you, top of the hat? It's me. But what does it mean? Ooh. Oh, there has to be more to this. Interesting, is it just me or has it been going staticky? Oh! Oh, interesting. Maybe if I just keep my light on it for a little bit longer. Oh, it's, it's getting brighter. So. Not enough? A little bit longer. Okay, wait. Oh! Supposed to... Oh, okay. Wait. Uh, are... To me. Yes. This is where I am now, right? Now I see it. To behind there. I would. So quite literally behind me, right? So over here. Oh. I had to dig deep to uncover what my father really wanted me to find. In the process. I realized what he was trying to tell me. What is behind the shelves? This house was nothing but a tomb. Oh. There was nothing left for me here. No answers. No solace. No closure. My true inheritance lay within. And then, just like that, it finally happened. For the first time in my life, I saw the world through my father's eyes. I was once told that insanity runs in my family. Let it run. Oh, when we are now our father. So wait, if we have a child, is this cycle just going to repeat itself? That's unfortunate. But yes, we finally got the last ending. Well, I hope you enjoyed that playthrough of Layers of Fear Inheritance. I don't think it matters which ending we get. The cycle is always set to repeat itself. Unless, of course, we don't forgive our father, in which case we just burn to death straight away. It's kind of a... It's kind of traumatic. As always, if you want to check out the game, I'll leave the link in the description below. If you enjoyed your time here, then please do like this video, subscribe to this channel. Other than that, have a spooky day and I'll catch you next time, guys.